Electronic prescribing is one of the most important aspects of an electronic medical record. Here are some best practices for prescription writing. From the clinical desktop, select the Meds tab. Be sure to move to Full Screen. Notice on this screen that you can print the medication list. You can also maximize all the details for each of the medications all at once rather than one at a time. Let's take lisinopril for example. The details here showed that the disease that was linked to was benign essential hypertension, who it was written by, the number of days it was dispensed for with refills, and thus a calculated evaluation or refill date, and also the action that was taken last time, which was record in this instance. If you right-click, you'll get a menu of many different options. The main ones we ask you to consider are discontinue for stopping the med and renew with changes, not just renew, but renew with changes. Let's select that option. Notice you can link this prescription to a patient's illness. Importantly, this name will print on the patient's prescription for patient safety. Also notice that all the dosage forms for this medication are now available. TouchWorks also recognizes the difference between brand and generic and their interrelationships. You can choose from one of the existing SIGs, or should you wish to, you can create a new SIG. If you were to change the number of days, you'll notice that the quantity also automatically changes, and a new date of evaluate or renew is automatically calculated. Notice that if you pull down complete, that this medication will drop off the patient's active medication list and go into the past medications list on that date. Finally, on this pull-down, you can specify printing a prescription, sending it to a retail pharmacy, sending it to a mail order. Notice that if you pull down Send to Retail, the patient's previously specified pharmacy displays. Keep in mind that narcotics and controlled substances such as Ambien, Valium, and Vicodin cannot be transmitted by retail or mail order. Instead, they must be either printed or recorded so that they can be called in to the pharmacy at a later time. Want to learn more? On the TouchWorks login screen, click on Tips and Tricks.